Now, the importance of gun safety is now front and center with multiple people recovering after being shot by accident in just the last week. At least one case involving guns that were received as Christmas gifts. ABC 4's Nicole Newman now joining us live in the studio. Nicole. Well, Nick, a 13 year old girl was shot last weekend in Ogden. Yesterday, it was a 70 year old man in Roy. The person who accidentally pulled the trigger in that shooting? His neighbor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It was a pellet similar to one of these that's believed to have penetrated the stomach of a 70 year old man from Roy Friday evening. So, from what I understand, it was a double aught buck shotgun cartridge, um, which means there's about Depending on the size, if it's a two and three quarter inch or three inch, it's going to have at least nine double lot buck pellets. The man was taking out his trash when he was hit. Through our investigation, we found that it was a neighbor who had a shotgun who accidentally discharged the shotgun. At the time, police say the neighbor across the street was cleaning a shotgun he got for Christmas. Police say the man thought it was empty. As it turns out, there was a cartridge in the chamber. Make sure you, if you're playing with your firearms or cleaning them or whatever it might be, uh, make sure that they're unloaded so that this doesn't accidentally happen. This incident comes after last Sunday's shooting of a 13 year old girl in Ogden. Police say she was accidentally shot by a relative. Treat the firearm like it's loaded. Uh, make sure you're on muzzle direction. Keep your finger off the trigger until it's. Pointed in a safe direction and you're ready to shoot, make sure of your backstop. Clark Apogee and the chairman of the Utah Shooting Sports Council says this advice covers all gun handlers from beginning to expert. Even people that have experience with firearms and, you know, have shot and have different firearms, because we're human, we tend to get complacent with the safety aspects, those basic safety rules. Now, the medical condition is still unknown of the 70 year old man. He was, however, conscious and alert yesterday when he was taken to the hospital. As far as the 13 year old girl, she is expected to make a full recovery. Live in studio, Nicole Newman, ABC 4 News.